Many activities over here in uh, feature 634. Willico is now pouring over the latest bit of the of the basket, and uh, that is its bottom. The center, and we have a piece of the room. At first, I thought the cross and center are, are too narrow compared to the ones in the, in, in the, in the wall. But if you think of how you make a basket, you have to start at the center and you have to make this very small circle. So you start with a small bundle, which is spiral out, and then the bundle can become a bit more big. And if you check the circumference of what remains we have here and the length of what we have here, you sort of flick this back. Um, we have an edge here, which pretty much goes here. I mean, if it has been conserved, I have to check it all, but it pretty much looks like, um, just by pressure, it's just been hmm. squashed that way. <gasps> we found you a basket! That's lovely! Complete one. <laughs> That's lovely! Well, I, I, I didn't see a rim hmm. here, but... Um, well, we'll look for it tomorrow. A sure. ring? <laughs> what kind of a ring you mean? Rim. rim. A rim. Yeah. Would it be a lid? <laughs> A gold no. one, Ruth. No. Yeah, I know, I thought you a, a tiny basket like this. A four centimeter high basket. Hmm. Yeah, well, you're right, okay. Mm -hmm. Uh-oh, I'm running out. Right. Basha and Tonya in um, yes. Teacher 631. Yeah. Basha and uh, Tonya have been cleaning out the bones gradually from this burial. And um, I think they've <coughs> taken out most of the limbs. I'm not sure. I can't quite see there. Yeah, it looks like it. It's got there and it's helping. Uh, back onto 634. She's in the fill here, but the basket has held her up. But we're still not sure that this is a fill for a burial. Looks like it. a couple of bones have turned up, but um, maybe here, maybe not. Uh, in the southeast corner. Southeast corner, the, the last player that actually was joining this platform with that platform in one floor was taken off. And so now we have a messy situation. We have a, we don't know what we have. But we, um, in this pit, you've been trying to work out some of the phasing and in other pits too. Okay, and um, Bukhut yes. and Laura have been drawing the oven and cleaning it a bit more here at this level of the floor. Okay, in this, um, in here, the screen wall, the plaster has been moved down to the level of the upper floor of Space 158 by Mira and Anne-Marie. And um, you can see they've been taking the plaster off and great big chunks and so on. So is that plaster from the later level or is that just... Um, later, maybe even earlier parts of our okay. In the north, we started to remove which? Feature 622. Oh. All right, the wall, the, the bricks as well. The late wall. Because we finished doing the plaster, take the plaster off, and now taking the. Yeah, not late completely. Wall. In the very corner, we okay. still haven't removed the plaster, but in this big section, we removed it and started taking off the bricks and also started taking of the midden behind it, space right. 85, uh, yes. in order to be able to actually remove the wall, we need to to dig out the midden in that area behind the wall, otherwise it's going to pour in. So that's Peja and the other, Bashak. 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 <laughs> okay, so what we have here, we removed the, uh, what do you call it, the packing of the latest floor and oh, yes. uh, then got onto another hacking and probably floor level under that which is uh, sitting on top of what seems to be an oven floor or something like that which this is uh -huh. oh i see yeah heavily burnt so i expected that to be uh, the house floor in this mm -hmm. space but it's not it's an oven and the rest of it, the orange stuff, is either packing wow, or something else. Good. I don't know. It's a messy right. situation. Um, Does that oven have a feature number yet? No. 
Over in feature 170, uh, we took away uh, floor number six. Um, I did with Michael Binder. And um, under that, we found near the eastern um, wall, there's a lot of plaster. I'll just go over there and have a look. Okay, here's one, uh, the top of 170, you can see that it's the northeast part is dominated by this quick plaster blob, which um, makes it very different in the packing, so there's no packing under that, it's just layers and layers of plaster, different from the rest of the platform, which is either packing for the on top of the seventh floor, or else it's part of the um, possible burial pit doesn't show up so well at the moment because it's just brown and brown. And I'm not sure what this white blob is. It may be a bench that's been built into the floor, the, you know, floor number seven, which is the first, uh, the latest of the old configuration of the that particular um, platform. So it could be a bench that existed for a number of uh, a long time. And. Uh, there are some little white holes there, I don't know if they're significant or not when we're trying to zero in on them.